Okay, we got a new feature in Notebook LM and essentially you can generate some high quality and professional infographics in just a few seconds. So these are some examples that I created in the platform, but I noticed that this is actually just a picture that was created by Gemini Nano Banana Pro. So this is not like a new technology. This is just one implementation from Google. And I think that's actually a good idea because there are so many use cases where infographics would be a much better way to understand information. So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can generate some infographics using Notebook LM alongside with some best practices to get the best result. So let's open Notebook LM. And after that, you can open the notebook that you have created or perhaps you can create a brand new one. But in this case, I'll just open this notebook about understanding electrical units. So to create an infographic, you can click this button or you can also click this pencil icon if you want to get some customization. And I do recommend to do that. So here you can select the language. You can also select the orientation or the aspect ratio of the picture. It could be a landscape, it could be portrait and also square, but personally, I do really like portrait because that's the typical dimension when it comes to infographic, but feel free to use any format that you prefer. Now for the level of detail, usually standard is good enough. I think it is kind of adaptive. It will know exactly if the infographic needs to be concise or detailed depending on the context of the topic. So I'll go with the standard setting. And for this section, I do recommend to use this prompt. So this is one basic prompt that I have tried multiple times and it is actually making the picture or the infographic to be very good. It has plenty of empty spaces because if you don't include this, there's a good chance that the design is going to be uh, to have lots of text and it is kind of overwhelming but by adding this instruction it will ensure the infographic to be uh, kind of giving you some breathing room so it's going to be a lot easier to read and also kind of more scannable anyway you can click generate and wait for about two minutes to generate the infographic so it is actually taking a bit more time than the typical gemini nano banana pro but i suppose that's because it needs to read plenty of sources in the notebook so that's why it takes a bit longer anyway i'll just skip forward and show you the result okay so the infographic has been generated and this is the result as you can see it is actually not very overwhelming it has this nice visual and also some context along the way to help the user or the viewers to understand the concept behind this topic so overall i think it looks really amazing it's actually very helpful and now to be honest i don't know if this is actually the best representation i'm not an electrician but at least from the visual standpoint, this looks really great. Now here, you can save the infographic to your device by clicking this download button and you'll get a full resolution or a picture. So Gemini Nano Banana Pro model actually support up to 4K pictures. So don't be surprised that you'll see the picture to be really, really big, like five megabytes inside. So that's actually high resolution. So you can use it on a big screen without actually introducing some artifacts. So yeah, that's basically how you can generate some professional infographics using Notebook LM alongside with the prompt that you can use to make the infographic to be as aesthetic as possible. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on my next video. I wish you a great day ahead.